New tonight, a big move from marijuana dispensaries. The House just passed the Safe Banking Act. Now that allows banks and also credit unions to work with the cannabis industry. That's right. 13 Action News reporter Austin Carter stopped by a local dispensary to see why it's more than a finance bill. It's a life safety bill. Yeah, well, the fact of the matter is many dispensaries right here in the valley rely on cash and that makes them potential targets for crime. But this dispensary right here behind me tells me this bill would be a game changer. The U.S. House of Representatives passing a bill that would allow legal marijuana businesses access to banking, a seemingly simple asset, but in the Canada business world hasn't been an easy one to have. Federal prohibition complicating efforts for businesses to get bank accounts, loans, and other financial services. So this is a huge win. Brandon Wigand of the Source Dispensary near Sahara in Rainbow says this is more than a finance bill, it's a life safety bill. That we carry large amounts of cash, we're right targets for individuals that want to take advantage of that. Brandon certainly knows the difficulty that dispensaries can face relying on cash transactions. Can't cut checks. You have to count your cash. You have to have a place to store that cash. Paying to employees, paying your bills. Nevada Attorney General Aaron D. Ford backing the bill, saying the state's act would bring billions of dollars of existing cash transactions into the regulated banking sector. The industry expected to generate revenue between 50 to 80 billion dollars over the next decade. This is the first time a cannabis bill has made it to the House floor and it passed uh, with the majority vote. So. If we can get this passed, it'll be a massive impact for the industry. Austin Carter, 13 Action News.